so I've heard there's a 100% way to tell whether there's sharks out here in this water. I'm gonna try it out. We got, oh, we got a spinner shark. All right, so we got a big day, got a big day. Blue Angels practices today. This is like gearing up for one of the biggest Blue Angels shows on the planet, Pensacola Beach. Home of the Blue Angels, NAS Pensacola. And I'm gonna go out there, I'm gonna meet Samantha, we're gonna watch the show at the Grand Marlin, and then I'm gonna head out to prove the old wise tale of how to tell if sharks are really in the water when you go to go in. It's gonna be a big day, guys, we're going. It's gonna be fun, here we go. Let's rock and roll. Boat traffic is wild out here. There's so many boats, it's so cool, it's so pretty. Y'all should be able to see this. I'll do my best to show y'all. That's where we're eating at, right there. Sitting right there. There's Samantha. Wearing my work uniform today. She was at work. Yep, did uh, free skin cancer screenings today at the beach from age two. I needed one of those. Why didn't you tell me? Well, you wouldn't have come out anyways. If I saw you there, thanks for coming by. We had a good time. So me and Samantha are at the Grand Marlin eating oysters. Yeah. And we're watching the Blue Angels. They're flying right over there as we're eating. So it's a good show. Friday night practice show. Yeah, tomorrow's the big day. We're going out on it. That's a whole lot of America right there. That's what I'm talking about. I've heard there's a 100% way to tell whether there's sharks out here in this water. I'm gonna try it out. I saw this on Facebook. I heard the trick is you gotta get really close to the water. So I'm getting really close. I'm knee deep. And I'm gonna get even closer. All right, so the trick is you gotta get this spoon slap full of salt water. You can't be half full, it's gotta be slap full. You gotta taste it. Yep, tastes like sharks. It's really salty. Slanty's really salty. It's really salty, that's what you want. Now I'm gonna go out there and I'm gonna try to catch one. I'm gonna prove this theory right. 100% right that you can 100% find a shark that tastes like that. So I'm out to prove if this little wise tail really worked. I mean, he was pretty confident in it. And I'm pretty confident in it. But I just gotta catch one. They're out here and I'm gonna find them. First bait, that's what I'm talking about. Just what I wanted to, a pinfish. Do your thing. That was prime bait. I got a, a penfish. Penfish are perfect tarpon bait. I'm not really going for a tarpon, but I'll take one if I, if I get one to hit. There's a lot of them out here right now. Really looking for a shark because I got to prove this theory straight. So, let me get that penfish back there. Black tip might hit him. And then I grab a couple more baits. They should be right in here. Check back with you in a minute.
when you're all messed up. It's a great relief to be on. That was pretty cool. They've been going back and forth, back and forth. They're getting ready for the uh, for the show. Uh, they're getting ready for the Blue Angels show this weekend. We got, oh, we got a spinner shark. Oh, we got off. Damn. Ah. Not slip. Dang. Well, that's one thing I didn't expect. I guess my knot slipped or broke one. Knot slipped right through. Big old spinner shark though. Let's try again. Man. Figured I had 60 pound wire and a big long leader. That wouldn't have happened, but I thought for sure I got that knot right. Sport fishing, guys. All right guys, so I did my best to prove to see if that shark method was true or not. The 100% shark testing method. And I sure enough hung one. So that means there's sharks in salt water. We know it, everybody knows it. I don't know why it's a question. There's sharks at the beach. Always have been, always will be. Hope you liked this video. Don't forget to like and subscribe. I'll see y'all next time, tomorrow or the next day. See you later. I want to stay like this forever. Stay right.